Hello, this time we will make simple cigarette smoke using the Niagara system. First, create a Niagara system. Set to GPU in properties to generate a large amount of particles. And check fixed bounds and local space. Set the life cycle mode to system so that the particle is affected by lifetime. And in spawn rate, set how much particles are spawned. Remove all but the initialized particle module from particle spawn. Then create the curl noise force. And in curl noise force, set the value as shown in the video so that the particles are created in a curled form. Then in the gravity force that affects the particles to fall down, set the curve value for the x, y, and z, respectively after setting make vector to decompose the vector. Then, set the curve at the decomposed z value so that the particles gradually rise. Next, in initialize particle, set the lifetime to direct set so that the time is consistent and set the alpha value of color to a lower value like in the video to make the particle look like smoke. Set the sprite size mode to uniform so the particles are created with a uniform size. Next, set the curve and drag so that the smoke gradually breaks as it rises. Next, create a scale sprite size and set the curve as shown in the video to change the sprite size according to the lifetime. Then, after creating a curl noise force in particle update, set a curve in noise strength and set a value in pan noise field to add a natural movement like smoke. Save and return to content drawer. Drag and drop the Niagara system you've created into the level to see if smoke comes out.